that okay for you guys? Of course, I'm like the only YouTuber to use his phone and has to ask, Hey, audience, how you doing? Whatever. Come on, okay. Anyways, guys, welcome back to Persona 5. I said I'm gonna keep going. Boink! <laughs> We're gonna keep going. I'm almost done. I just gotta wait a few days now. <laughs> Shouldn't she explain that comeback hole? Oh, that was probably the best comeback I've ever seen in anything. And our popularity is rising. Should you no! It will not! Well, let's just play a game, I guess. Hi, everyone! Time to do some shopping! Hunger charm? No. I'm not fine. Well, I oh. guess let's play a game. Power intuition. How do you do this? Okay. So, power intuition. You got it. Kung Fu guy. Oh, it's like it's that Kung Fu guy again. It's oh, it's me special. How do you do that? Hey, wait. How do you do that? That's what I'm supposed to do is I'm supposed to go down and then up. Yo, what's up? Elections are this weekend. These goddamn election cars are so loud, too. They need to stop making me panic, damn it. This seems to be more like a big party than an election. Yeah, one that's just for Shido. His followers are essentially part of his cult at this point. Hmm. I think I finally figured out what seems off lately. What do you mean? News stories outside of Shido have dropped off the face of the map far too quickly. He's all people want to talk about. It's like they aren't interested in anything else. Is he brainwashing them? Mind controlling. Mind control. Mm -hmm. That does seem possible under these circumstances. If people stop thinking for themselves, they'll be free from both anxiety and responsibility. And Shido is the perfect thing to put their trust in. All that's left is to believe that he can bring them happiness. Then they'll self. Then they're all set. I can't believe this. Either way, we have to do everything we can. Brainwashing. This is one way to look at it. Let's show people this truth. The truth behind all this. I should write something. And I'm gonna say real quick. Eighty-eight hours. Oh, it's just an hour. Okay. Oh. Yes. Yes. I want to talk. Alright, EY, I'm coming. Oh, it's freezing. It's been really cold. Yeah, I know. Yep, I want to work. I'll work for you to do up show sometime later. Good. You got a minute? All right, that's good for today. Oh, but there's something I want to talk to you about. It's about that secret suit dimension. Secret suit dimension. There's more to it than I, you, well, than my having been in the Yakuza. I just wanted to make sure you don't go saying something stupid if you run into Kauri, Kauru again around here. Back when I was working with the Hashiba clan, some crazy lady came around our office. Must have been over 10 years ago. She had this baby with her. The whole time she was with, she kept going on about she wanted to sell it. What? Figured she was just some cracked up junkie looking for drug money. But then I was told, I told her no. She sat the baby down and ran off. The baby was calm. <sighs> Thinking back on it, I'm still not sure why I took him in. Not only did I have to leave the clan, but now I'm stuck running this shop I don't even like. Every day is a bit of ba uphill battle. I still haven't managed to tell Kaoru. I was in the Yakuza though. Why not? Let me ask you something. How would you feel if you found out your parents were wrapped in some dirty shit? That's how my mom was. She spent every night out drinking, running around town with all sorts of guys. I couldn't stand to see her destroy herself like that. I often wish I could have had someone else as my mom. So, I didn't want want to make Kaoru 
go through the same thing. I wanted to make sure he had a good childhood. That's why I left the clan. I did everything according to the code, but now Sooth is dragging me back. Once he remembered I run this fake gun shop, he, he, can, back, he came by asking me to make custom models for him. Though he wasn't really asking, the bastard forced me into it by threatening to kill Kaoru every... Kill? What did I say? Tell! Okay, that's a kill. Truth is, Suda's got all sorts of dirt. Not just on what happened when Ka Kaoru was a baby, Kaoru, but on me and the rest of my family too. Who knows what happened if Kaoru learned, learned the truth. Suda isn't going to stop there though. I'm sure he'd go on and tell everyone else he could. Oh well, when it's all said and done, he's going to try and take everything I have. Shit. The world gets out of my gets about gets out about my past. People are gonna treat Kaoru like he's no different than me. After all, everyone knows shitty parents end up making shitty kids. And once he got that stig he'll, stigma, he'll be stuck with it. When shit goes wrong, he'll always be the one that gets blamed. That's how it was with me. That's why I turned it to the Yakuza. Nobody else wanted it but except me. That's also why I couldn't turn Suda down. He's just got too much power. <laughs> You're so kind. <sighs> Don't give me that exaggerated bull crap. I ain't kind at all. Anyways, I was trying to sell stall suit with bullshit prototypes. I figured out was a way to stop him. But that bastard's real good at keeping his cards close to his chest. Plus, he caught wind of what I was trying to do and started keeping tabs on me 24-7. Thankfully, that's just about when you showed up, kid. Sorry. Sorry for bringing all that shit up out of the blue. You probably don't want anything to do with me after that, huh? Ah, uh, don't make assumptions. Stick around for the gun. Don't make assumptions. <sighs> it's cool if you want to act tough and all, but don't forget to watch your, watch out for yourself, kid. All right. Just remembered, I never. I just remembered, I never gave you a reward for that info. <laughs> How about I give you a discount on the special menu? That should keep you quiet for a while. Pretty good deal, huh? Yay! Been talking way really too much. Oh, it's left hand new. <laughs> All right. Damn, it's late. I should get the game home. Kyle has been eating a little ton lately after cram school. He's probably gonna have another growth spurt soon. Anyway, I'm closing up for today. You should head home too. Yay, my proficiency! All right. Later. Take it easy, kid. Yep. You too, boss number two. Is our popularity going up? Not a little bit. You support the fantasy. Oh, it's back to supporting, isn't it? <laughs> That's weird. The elections this weekend. Mr. Shiva's moment isn't slowing down at all. Momentum. Did he fall ill because of that Phantom Thieves incident? People are making some noise about it, but it won't matter. It's almost scary how popular he is. It is? The election's at the end of this week, right? Well, Shido's gonna win anyway. Uh, Not that I asked for your opinion on the election. Well, no matter what the cause was, the election is heading in the right direction. Before we knew it, Shido had everyone in the palm of his hand, deceiving people so well that they don't even realize it. Just how influential, influential is she? Only one thing left to do is wait for the outcome. Hey. Shoot, no. 